How's it going today, folks? Daryl here, another Mandela Earth Changes update. We've got all three sides of Australia done except for the north coast, so I figure we better finish it off. And we can go watch some other stuff for a bit and let this cook for a week or something. See how it's doing. As you can see, there's a ton of activity up here. For sure. I'll have to go back do some before and afters. I can't tell if this land is growing at all or if this, it's all just getting chewed out. And it looks like it's going to lose a lot more here because there's more of this black, real dark water that shows up inland before it makes a break for the ocean. Same thing along here, all this stuff is very likely on its way out. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Okay, we're going the wrong way anyway, getting sidetracked and running back. We already covered that coast going down, so... <laughs> hey, you know what? I'm not sure, but these could be new islands in here, believe it or not, from our last visit a few days ago. So, any uh, checking in on this yourself? That's something to look at. This island here, too may have been left behind, but may have come back up new after the water took the other stuff away. Some of these are likely quite new. I'm going to move along fairly quickly here. There's a lot of this stuff that if you came back and really looked in on it, it would be pretty surprising. See, like these places here, where this is starting to do what it is here, this is going to wash out for sure, and this, it's already going, but I wouldn't be surprised, oh yeah, because we got water coming here too, but anytime you see this, this thin beach like this, that seems to stay once it starts spreading out like this, then you're going to get a bunch of land washing out. Like here, see all this sand back here? When we check in again, a few days, maybe a week, the coast will be right in here. That's good though, because these real straight lines, they look goofy. They need to get, like, have some erosion and stuff happen like this. So they look a lot more natural, just like he's doing. Doesn't look like much of an artist when he first starts, but... <laughs> Once he gets rolling, gets the final carving done, actually looks pretty special. Yeah, I was asking in the last video too, anyone from Australia, if you could comment as to if all this super thick forest is standard for your place. It's not really how I knew it. Oh boy, you got troubles coming here. So this dark patch, this is going to turn wet, especially where the sand is all the way it is. So this, this whole inlet here is going to come in long ways, at least this far, and then branch off at least two directions for sure. This is, yeah, this it's going to come in here too. For sure, places to keep an eye on. Well, that's coming in. It looks like this one's getting ready to head out. It's growing some fingers there. Wow, trippy. That's still be pretty neat shape there. See, this is a little more advanced state of this back here. See the sand there and the wet here. It's just a little, whoa, that's not the right, this one here, that's, oh, that ain't the one we were, the right one, yeah, no, where'd it go, man, oh yeah, right there, jeez, <laughs> but, yeah, you see the water just doesn't, nothing holds it, right, once it decides it's spreading, away she goes, sure acts a lot like it's laying on kind of 
more like a flat surface or something. It's weird. <laughs> it just runs in and around the cracks and low spots. Wow, that looks nice in there. Looks nice from up here. Good view. I wouldn't want to be down there. Doesn't look inhabited anywhere over here, though. So, I would say there's some big changes coming by the looks of all this. This is getting ready to bleed out. And this here. All this will fill up with water. This here. That's going to be neat, though. It's going to leave some islands here. The way it's filling in here, it'll come right around. Probably send a river up this way. Probably join this one by the looks of it. Wow, this stuff's all headed for the sea, too. Crazy. Great. Ooh, there's a great patch, too. Holy cow. Yeah, see, this stuff is really undergoing some changes along the north shore here. I think it'll be quite entertaining to come back in a week or so and see just what's changed. I'll have to do some side-by-side -side stuff before and after videos pretty soon once we've logged a little bit more stuff. That's the thing, everything's changing so fast. It's I really want to get as much of the current record as I can logged while I can before it all changes. Isn't this awesome? One of these, any one of these nice thick treed islands in here would be just sweet to live on. Take any one of those. <laughs> Check this shit out. Isn't that what's... Wow. You know... Oh, wow. Yeah, this, uh, believe it or not, I think there may have been a city here. If you check the East Coast video, there's some real heavy metropolis areas where it's just nothing but washout now. I suspect this may have been one. I hope we have some earlier footage. Because, you look at this, I could be wrong, but I was in here like three, four hours ago, and this... This runway here was pretty hatched the way it is, but this one here pretty much went from end to end. It was getting a little soft looking at this end, but now you see it's like half decayed off the ends. So, I don't know, I think if I'm putting a dollar down on something, I say this whole bunch of settlement and everything going to be gone here sometime in the near future. Could be wrong on that, though. I might be going to leave a big island there. Love the look of the river, say. Isn't that cool? Alright. Yeah, see, there's going to be significant changes yet in all these areas. These river valleys are going to widen out a lot. Got another inland lake popping in here. A few of them. Yeah, this it's all going to change still. We see the sandy stuff. Isn't that cool looking artwork though? Nifty. Look at that shit. What we got going on here? Looks like this part's growing. We've always got stuff leaving, but you always got new stuff coming in at the same time somewhere. Uh, oh, I thought it was one of them little sandbar things. Still, I want to get a good shot of this, because I bet you this changes. Right over here. Alright, off we go. Okay, we're coming up on ten minutes already in the last couple videos ran a little bit long, so let me pan out and see where we are here. I'm going to try and make darn sure I give you back a little on this one. Holy crap, this land bridge has gone cuckoo. Wow. Yeah, this is 
got plans for going places, I think. Yowzers. <laughs> Stevens Island, Bergen Gura Island, Drysdale Island. There's, I know there's some of you, two or three actually, more and more, I think, from Australia. If, if you guys could let me know if all these islands have been here long term, or are these new to you guys? Wow, see all this... The lighter colored, well, it's, yeah, it's, it's going to say lighter colored blue, the more activity, but not really. It's kind of just more of a different activity because this darker colored stuff is always significant land loss, too. Yeah, this, boy, your shape of your whole place here is really gonna change a lot I think by the looks of her you look how far these are coming in oh boy yeah that this whole all this stuff here is gonna go away on you all this all this all of this for sure all gone in here that whole coastline is gonna move way in if I had to guess, by the size of this river valley and the depth of it, by the time that sea all moves into here, this the delta part will kind of end up up in this area, way, way inland from where you are. Okay, have to take note of what islands we got here, because... There's a good chance we're going to see some more. See, they're even called Bountiful Islands, so... <laughs> we'll probably have more of them coming. And this color in here, all this silty looking stuff, that indicates major change on the way. That's going to be a big cut in there. Wow. Huge cut. Holy, I think all this, believe it or not. Yeah, because it's coming dark here. This stuff, guaranteed, you can mark my words, all of this dark colored stuff that's coming in here is going to start heading to join with this stuff that's coming in this way. And you're going to have a lot of water inland there. You'll end up with like a snaky ass peninsula thing here, I think. It's going to be pretty cool. Really. Okay. Well, I think we got her covered, believe it or not. Oh, this looks kind of significant. Yeah, there's, oh boy, so does this. Okay, maybe we're not quite covered. <laughs> yeah, look at all that. See this lighter colored water? It starts out as this darker stuff when it first starts popping up. Kind of like that this stuff here and then it'll do this then your land is gone all gone but then something else comes <laughs> it's even better and looks cooler I am modern art got nothing on this stuff good fatty check this shit out for a while way better than going to an art gallery I tank anywho Oh, let's see. Look at this. What the heck is that shit? Wow. Trippy. I would have to say you're going to be losing some land in here, too. Wow. Boy. It looks like you've already lost some pretty significant bits. That East Coast video, you should see, it's kind of some of the more urban areas that have been hit hard with the water. The, what is left 
there's it's all set up kind of like the Florida Keys just all little snaky bits of land with houses packed on them it still looks pretty neat though okay we finally made it yeah you just all this a lot of stuff running from inland to out out to sea on there still all right i think we've almost made it to the tip here boy this is really gonna wash in here too really bad that's yeah wow blue's a really big piece there for sure and we're certainly going to see significant change in through here. Here's them dark spots, you know, for sure. When it pops in this dark, this is coming out. Whoosh! Down she goes. It's here too. Going to go join this. Guaranteed. All right, there we go. We've circumnavigated the old, uh, well, we've Going all the way around <laughs> Australia. Northeast, southwest, she's covered, so we'll let it perk for a week or so, and then we'll come back with some, hopefully, some before and afters that are pretty interesting. Have a good one, folks.